Microsoft has made PowerShell available on a variety of different platforms now, not just Windows. So we're going to walk through, just for the fun of it, a quick install of PowerShell in Ubuntu. So you see my VM here. I'm running Ubuntu version 18, I think. Um, so we're going to try to do a quick install of it. And it's really easy. They've made it available in the repository. So we just open Ubuntu software and we do a search for PowerShell. See if we can spell power right. We do a quick search for PowerShell. And it finds right here the latest version of PowerShell for Ubuntu. So I'm going to click on it and I'm going to say I want to install PowerShell. Give our little approval here and it starts our PowerShell installation, which moves along pretty quickly. Okay, we're just about done. 99% there we go okay now PowerShell is active on our system so I'm gonna go to my software and I'm going to find PowerShell and here it comes and this is regular PowerShell current version PowerShell 7.3.7 .7. so current version of PowerShell 7 now uh, something we need to be aware of this is PowerShell and the commands work the same way but it is PowerShell for the Linux system. So we still have that same verb noun construct and we can see all of our different commands. But there's going to be some differences between the way you use PowerShell in Windows and PowerShell in any other system, which reflects the operating system. For example, I'm going to do a get service, which on Windows gives me a list of all available services. In uh, my Ubuntu Linux system, it says, hey, that gave, we don't know that. Git service is not recognized as the name of a commandlet, which is appropriate because Linux doesn't have services, it has daemons. But if I do a git process, okay, we do have a bunch of processes, and that's because both Windows and Linux use processes. So, it's real quick and easy to install. It functions the same way. You have the same syntax, the same structure, but realize that it's customized for the underlying operating system. So that's how you install PowerShell on a uh, Ubuntu system. Now they do have installers available for other Linux systems as well, but this just illustrates how we do it on an Ubuntu system.